outcome. So you have to get your BPO, your best possible outcome, out of corporate America. And step one to doing that is remembering to stay positive, and that's Try. step one in growing your EQ muscle. And it's something I just am now learning that I wish I had learned a long time ago. Because there have been so many times where I know I was mistreated. I know I was talked too badly. I know that I was looked over, pushed out, just Plymouth Rock fell on me <laughs> at work. And I know it, and you know it, and, and they know it. That crowd but is here. I don't I, I don't have the answer except for what was the wrong answer is how I reacted in those situations. I did not act out of love. I did not act out of positivity. That's I me. acted out of anger and I reacted. And that did not give me my best possible outcome. <clears throat> and so I realize now in all of the self reflection I've done over this past year that the way to win in corporate America, step one is staying your happy self and not letting the bullshit get to you. Never let them see you sweat. Never. And that's step one to win. Over the course of the next couple of weeks, every Sunday I'm going to release a new episode that's going to have tips on how you get through this week. And so this is week one of that. And so the tip is be positive. If you're frustrated, smile and say, you know what, let me go back and think about what it is that I need to respond to and let me get back to you on that. Or if you have to answer in the moment, say, hey, you know, I want to take some additional time to process uh, this information and make sure that I'm giving you the best information back. You know, take the time to process the emotion, especially anger and frustration. Mm -hmm. Do that with a smile. And also, find your venting partner. Every we all need a venting partner. We all yes. need to get that. Find your venting partner. But I would say find it outside of work. Yes. Unless you have that one person. Like, I have to work. Outside work. And, I'm my work bees. You know, we're tight as glue and thick as bees. So I know that that venting doesn't go anywhere else. But you don't want people to feel your negative emotion, your negative energy, your, and I say negative, I mean your frustration and your anger. You don't want people to feel that. You don't want people to know that. What you want people to know of you is class, dignity, and grace. And that's the narrative that you are going to start creating for yourself this week. So, suck it up. Suck it up. If you got a vent, email me. Ask at trillandia.com. Yeah, I will. <laughs> but go in there with your armor on, which means you will pray before you get out your car. And you're going to ask God to shine your light in this space, regardless of any darkness that's trying to come over you or be in your way. Okay? Now, my final thoughts about National Black NK. 